So we are here on the Smith machine and I'm gonna demonstrate an upright row. Okay, there's two variations to the upright row. There's one we're gonna go about shoulder width apart, which is your standard upright row. Then we're gonna go outside shoulder width. Basically about the rings here on the Smith machine and we're gonna come up, both of which target the back of the shoulder area and upper traps, giving you that nice little shape here. So what are you going to do? Approach the bar, put your thighs just up against the bar, maybe slightly back about an inch. And once again, a regular upright row. You're gonna unlock the bar, chest up, chin up. And what you're gonna do, pull up, try to get above chest level. And it's very important to, no to note, elbows are higher than the hands. Okay, so if you're coming here, that's gonna work the forearm and the bicep that's in proper form. So what you wanna do, once again, arch the back, chest up, chin up, <sighs> exhale up. My elbows are higher than the hands and you'll be able to feel that in the back of the shoulders. Slight bend in the knees always helps take a little pressure off the spine. As so. So that's a regular upright row. Now I'm going to show you a wide upright row. Once again, this is gonna target a little bit more of the outside of the shoulders as opposed to the trap muscles. So approach the bar, thighs up against just about an inch off. Grab the outside rings, unlock the bar, chest up, chin up, arch the back, exhale up. Elbows are higher than the hands as you can see. And secure the Smith back in. That is two variations of the upright row.